Look at these wide range of products. They also contain alcohol as one of the ingredients, and for each product, alcohol serves different purposes. In chemistry, what is the meaning of alcohol? All alcohols have a hydroxyl or OH group attached to them. The hydroxyl group is the functional group for alcohols. Based on the structural formula, let's write the molecular formula of alcohol. First, identify the total number of carbon atoms. Then, write the number of carbon atoms as a subscript. If there is only one atom, we just write the symbol of the atom. Next, count the total number of hydrogen atoms which are directly attached to the carbon atom. There are three hydrogen atoms directly attached to the carbon atom. So, write the symbol of hydrogen, then three as the subscript. Finally, write the functional group of alcohol. Naming alcohol is about the same as naming an alkane. Alkane with one carbon atom is called methane. Alcohol is named by replacing the last alphabet E of alkane with OL. The general formula of alcohol is CN H2N plus 1 OH, where N is a whole number starting from 1. Ethene, produced during the cracking of petroleum and steam, is piped through a furnace. The furnace increases the temperature of the mixture to 300 degrees Celsius. The mixture is subjected to a pressure of 60 atmospheres using phosphoric 5 acid as a catalyst. Ethanol is formed in the reaction chamber. Ethanol vapor and steam is then cooled in a condenser into a liquid mixture of ethanol and water. The ethanol is separated from water by fractional distillation. We can also prepare ethanol in the laboratory using fermentation. Let's take a look at the chemical properties of ethanol. Click the play button to see what happens when ethanol vapor is heated strongly over porcelain chips.